And also Senator Oluremi Tinubu has called for increased investment in women to accelerate progress in all economic sectors. She emphasized that investing in women is not just a charity, but a strategy to build Nigeria's future. Tinubu called for cooperation from all stakeholders and encouraged women to help each other. She also called for collective efforts to achieve urging women to pull up one sister at a time. This call comes as the world celebrates International Women's Day every March 8. In a swift reaction to the kidnap of more than 200 pupils in Chikun local government area of Kaduna State and insecurity in other parts of the country, First Lady of Nigeria, Oluremi Tinubu, is calling for capital punishment for kidnapping this, she says, will serve as a deterrent for the heinous crime in the country. She says the abduction of school children is hampering the rights of education and free movement of all. Being young people is sick, cruel, and a coward. Yes, yes. yes. Enough is enough. Mm. And um, I call on the state government mm. that once we take hold of them, we deserve capital punishment. Why don't they take people their size? Why are they torturing our children? What they are doing is trying to kill our future. We all know parents, when we are old, we rely on our children, that, and we see them that our investment has not gone to waste especially when they are successful. Why would you go and take them from schools? Why? I don't really know. But right now, I think enough is enough. As a former lawmaker, I believe that the, any, or any one of them captured is our capital punishment. Yes, yes. I say it, and I believe most mothers would believe that. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.